Hello everyone, I'm Asamia Plays and welcome back to my channel. I like to play video games and oh, here are my cats, Onion and Garlic. On today's episode, I'll be doing a lot of grinding towards my next three villagers, but that's okay, we'll have a lot of fun today. Please enjoy the next episode on Animal Crossing New Horizons. I started off today by checking my mail and seeing all the boots I ordered. Then I wanted to work towards getting my hybrid flowers, so I went and started planting some of those. And hey, finally I got my last iron nugget to fill my shop. Here I am collecting more resources, and oh look, I got a gold nugget. Don't know how useful that will be. Then I picked up my message in a bottle, and dug up my money tree. Don't worry, I did plant one. Can't have Palm Bay without some palm trees now. These will definitely come in useful later. Hey Gulliver. There's only one way to wake up Gulliver. I'm usually hoping to get a pagoda or a katana from Gulliver, but now that I'm doing a beach island, I'm able to use some different items of his. While I'm looking for Gulliver parts, I went ahead and planted some more palm trees. Caught a bug. Then I found a Gulliver part. And another. And another. And another. Finally, all five. Then I went inside and sold some stuff to Timmy. All the shells I collected. Then I went and ordered my five irons for today. And then I went and helped him build a shop. Yes, I'll donate. Timmy seemed very surprised that I brought him everything at once, but I was glad to, so in order to get Nook's Cranny built as soon as possible, in return, he gave me some nice items to use around the house and to use on the island. Then I placed the shop down Can't wait for this to open. Then I went ahead and started chopping some trees to get more wood. No net. Yep, no net. Time to run. Collecting some more weeds to get off the ground. Hey, got a balloon. And I got socks. Always wanted some socks. Then I wanted to put some stuff in my storage. My inventory is getting kind of full. Alright, see you guys tomorrow. Also, I am going to time travel in this Let's Play. I decided it'll make the game more interesting since this is my first gameplay series and it will help with the progress towards our main goals. The next day, Tom Nook announced that the shop had opened. Then, in the middle of his announcements, he got interrupted by a phone call, so he walked away. Alright, so I started the next day off by checking my mail to see my Gulliver item. And I got a veil. I think I can rock it. Then I went to water my flowers. Collect some shells. And learn my first reactions. Thank you, Phoebe. Then I wanted to check out Nose Cranny. Oh, look, Mabel. 
cannot wait to get her shop. Also, I gathered the fish and insects from the shore. Um, I don't want to upgrade my museum because I want to keep it the same. I think I can make a cool build out of it. And this cranny had a lot of good stuff today. I bought one of everything. Wanted to catch up with Tom Nook to see if he had anything for me to do and turns out I have three villagers that want to move in. Also, he wants me to prepare a bridge. So let's get to work. Went ahead and built the bridge. Then placed the bridge. Went back to Tom Nook to tell him I placed the bridge. Now he wants me to place it on the three plots. One. Two. And three. Then I made all the items and started placing them around the houses. Went back to Tom Nook. Tell him that I put everything down and everything was finished. Also during this conversation, he'll be giving me the fences, which is great because I want to work towards getting a three star island as soon as I possibly can. As a reward for placing down the villager homes, Tona gave me some fences to use around my island. As I was running around my island, I ran into Gulliver again. I popped another balloon. Let's see what I got. Oh nice, a DIY. While it gets a little tiring collecting all the communication parts, it's always worth it because you never know what you can get. Back at Nook's Cranny to make some bells. Thank you. Then I started to place some fences down. Like I was saying before, I really want to get the three stars as fast as I can. So I'm going to be working a lot on that, placing items everywhere, uh, especially around my house, around really everywhere. I think that palm tree was a nice touch. Wanted to add all the items that I had stored up just to put it around to work towards that three stars. At first I was trying to be organized with how I was arranging my items, but then I decided it didn't matter too much since I would be removing them soon anyways. Alright, that wraps up things for today. A lot of grindy stuff today, but it'll be worth it here soon. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Please do leave a comment below if you have any questions about anything. Till next time.